Hello, this is H.J. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Disgaea! We've still got the uh, same file as we do last time, but I decided to get a couple bandits' hands to head towards Bow Castle. So, let's head on over there, and uh, when I created this file, I already did the first battle there, but, so, but we can just redo it. So, and this battle is identical the first time as it is the second time. So, uh... Yeah, we just got a few low-level guys. Yeah, level 2,000. That's nothing. I wouldn't worry about them. But I do want to take those guys out. So uh, let's take him out. Let's get Flan out there. Get a good Terra Star spell. If you're going to be ready for the Lord of Terror himself, you might as well, you know, be able to get through this battle really fast. How bad could this possibly be? Whoa, four... Oh, yeah, it's only 4,000 damage. Yeah, nothing I'm uh, seriously worried about. So, all right, got him. So yeah, first battle, really easy. Next battle, not so much. So let's just heal up after that one. A few nicks and bruises, but nothing we can handle, or can't handle. So now, let's head to the real battle here, the Lord of Terror himself. How big could he possibly be? Whoa, holy Who crap! the hell is this guy? You gotta be kidding! Level 4000?! <laughs> the Lord of Terror Ball! The legend was true. You see? I was pronouncing it correctly! I'm not crazy! Okay, so, first things first. Let's take a look at his stats there. Holy cow. Yeah, we want to uh, take that guy out as quickly as we can. So, first things first. Let's uh, get my thief forward a little bit. And let's steal one of his uh, items. Let's start with the nemesis there. And, uh, yeah, that ought to be good enough. Let's throw him back into the base panels. Base panel, so he can live to fight another day. Or, steal another day. And, let's see. Now what I want to do is I want to get Laharl, my cosmic hero, or Etna, if you're using that. Which, you probably should be. And my Shogun. And let's bring out my mages that I created originally to teach spells to Flan, but they also know the mighty Braveheart spells from all the level grinding that I've been doing. I've been using that quite a bit, actually. So four of those ought to be good enough. Just a good one by three ought to do. I'm not even going to have uh, Krona get in on the action there. He's just kind of there for utility, like throwing things around and stuff. So, okay, buff them all up, put them back in the base panel. Let's see, uh, ah, there you are. Okay, what are you weak to? Uh, ice. Okay, so if I go there, I should be able to stay out of harm's way, I think. Let's see. Yes, okay, good. Man, that guy's huge, and he's st staying on one tiny little panel. Show him the power of crab legs, Flan. Okay, let's send the uh, Nazgard it, all the way to the left there, and leave everyone else in the base panel for now. Ball is probably going to go after the mages. Ow! I uh, didn't expect him to uh, go after Flan like that. Whoops. Uh, I hope you can heal yourself there, Flan. I wonder how good my healing spells are about now. Let's find out. Nice. Okay. Yeah, let's... Uh, now what we want to do is lure Ball, or Bow, all the way up here. I think his name is supposed to be pronounced like Bowel, as in like Bowel Movements. Except without the W, obviously. So I can't, I heard that the uh, Hebrew pronunciation of his name has an apostrophe in there called Baal. Or 
something like that. I don't know, that's just what people are telling me. I've heard that in Diablo, the Diablo games, they call him Bale. I don't know how you get Bale out of that. Well, I know how, but I don't think it makes a lot of sense anyway. Okay, so, let's see, let's throw you in the back there now. Now we're just not even going to bother healing. Now we're just going to go all out here. Except with Krona, who's going to hide. And let's see, let's get a good Terra Ice spell on him. Let's see, how many guys can I get in there? Hmm, just the one. Well, I can at least get Laharl going, maybe. Oops, nope, a little more Laharl. I would like to try and get these guys in on the action. This round. Let's see, go as far forward as you can. Yeah, this is where I wish I had Etna to use, uh, what is that one? The, uh... Actually, no. You want to go all the way to the left. I wish I had Etna to use Pretty Raid on Ball. Oh. Uh. Hmm. Okay, I guess that'll work. I was thinking I forgot something, but no. Whoa! Man, that hurts! So that's what I've been doing to my enemies. Okay, yeah, I think that's all... Yeah, that's all of his moves. So uh, now we can just uh, disable everything and... Uh, Go all out! Have fun! Let's see, let's go with a good Calamity Drive. Try to get you moving up there. And, let's see, a good Dimension Slash. Will that hit him? I can't tell, his sprite's so big. <laughs> wow, that guy's huge. Let's see. And that ought to do. In, uh... Ultima 3, didn't Exodus, like, on the grid of the uh, of the battlefield, didn't Exodus have, like, take up almost, or, like, four tiles on the grid like that? I forget. I was just thinking of bosses that uh, take up more of the battlefield than most bosses do. But anyway, okay, let's see, we want to just barely hit him. Try to spread out so he can't hit multiple party members with Sword Rain, or whatever that other move he has is. Uh, what is that one? Grand Sword. Okay. Oddly enough, that's what I thought it was, but I was thinking, wait a minute, no, that can't be right. Ow. He's so buff that he just has to stand there, and his aura will kill you. Wow. Can I at least get in... No, I, well, I can stab him, I guess. Okay, well, at least I can do something. Back up. Not bad. You can't even deal 100,000 damage with your regular attack. Ow. How many do we got here? 200 grand? Yeah, you can probably finish him with a uh, good knight server. Try to let Laharl have the last word, or not. Okay, we can, uh... You know, I'm just gonna wait around, because I think it's appropriate for Laharl to defeat the Lord of Terror himself. Let's, uh, defend here, and call it a day. We almost got him. Whoa. How much movement range do you got? Wow, I didn't realize... Oh! I forgot to steal that Super Robo suit. Whoops. No wonder this is taking me so long. Well, I do want to get that, because that's the ultimate armor in the game. It boosts just about all your stats, really. Let me see what you got now. Yeah, that even boosted your movement by three. Whoops. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, let's take a look at that. Let's get rid of... Can I just get rid of that? Okay, there we are. Oh, no, no. Okay. Yeah, take a look at that. Yeah, look at those stats! It even boosts your movement by three. Holy cow! Yeah, it's really nice. Okay, now, finish him, Maharl. Ha! Gotcha. The mighty ball is dead. I'll be a little quiet. Oh, I guess there's no voice acting here. 
Okay, I guess I can get flat my gums then. Huh? Who could it be? Well, how many netherworlds do we got in this place anyhow? Oh, so that's how he really died. I like the music they got here. An appropriate way to end the game. For real. Oh. Nuts. Well, we finally defeated him once and for all. Well, most of you can probably guess who the voice is. Same guy who said that in the, the regular ending. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, mid-boss. No, no, it's, uh, his dad. Well, yeah, they're the same guy, but, you know. Yeah, K King Krachevskoy, or at least what's left of him. Now, at least, I'm not 100% sure how the plot works. My understanding is that... Uh, what was it? Yeah, uh, King Krachevskoy and Lamington were already talking about uniting the Netherworld and Celestia and all that stuff. But then Baal came along and, well, King Krachevskoy had to stop him. So he sealed him away, but then he died. And then I think, uh, what was it? I think, uh, Lamington, uh, not revived him, but, uh, uh, reincarnated him into what he is now, uh, mid-boss, or Vyres. That's why he looks like him and all that stuff, and that's why Lamington was saying something about using up all of his power and how he can only... S his power even has its limits and such. So, at least that's my interpretation of what happened. So, he, tra he reincarnated him so they could finish the deal and unite the two worlds and that's why Lamington sent uh, Flan into the netherworld and all that stuff. So, let's see what happens if I go back into the Lord of Terror's area. <laughs> uh, Prinny? Oh, it's, uh, Prinny Bow. Okay, man, he's got a lot more stats. Well, let's see what we can do here. Let's, uh, try again. No, I'm not going to beat him. No way, not with the stats that I got. Oh, nuts. I can't even steal from him? Crap. Uh, hide. Maybe I can, uh, try again. That's what happens when you, uh, fail to steal. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. Okay, let's, uh, see if I can try something else. Oh, Jesus Christ! Two million damage? One shot? I wonder if my dream hands would help me out here. Probably not. Oh, man. Yeah, I have no... No way. Okay, well, let's... Let's see what I can do. Show us your best moves, guys! Let's see. Go with good avalanche. Then... Let's see. Good night sever. I'll use all my most powerful abilities. Let's see, you're weak to wind, so we should be fine there. Let's try that. Holy crap! I can't even scratch the guy! Yeah, uh, we don't stand a chance against him. And, uh, sorry viewers, but I do not feel like grinding for another 20 hours just to kill this one guy. So, and I don't have a file I created in advance. So, sorry, I'm not going to beat Prenny Bow. Uh, to my knowledge, there's no additional storyline progression like we got at least against the original Bow and everything like that. So yeah, I'm not I'm not really worried about it. So there's no additional endings. It's just there for the additional challenge. If you feel like grinding that much, I do not. So sorry, 
I'm not going to be taking him on. Oh, there was one thing I want. I couldn't show. I uh, can't show you now, but uh, when you defeated Bal, uh, Laharl's title was changed from Prince to Tyrant. And from what I heard, uh, when you try to pass a bill in the Senate now, uh, you basically can pass anything you want, almost guaranteed. Or at least that's what I heard. I've never actually tried that myself, because by the time you get it, you really don't need it anymore. But it's there, at least that's what I heard, I don't know. So, Okay, well, that's all for the post-game of Let's Play This Guy. I hope you've enjoyed it, but this LP is not over yet, viewers. Uh, I've still got some bonus endings that I want to show off, so yeah, we've still got a little bit of a ways to go. But what is really the end for Laharl? Not Bal. Find out next time on Let's Play This Guy. This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.